Okay, so my cooler has had it's updated uh, the reflectix in it for almost a full day, and I still have ice. I mean, it's like mostly ice still, which is really incredible. Because before I'd have ice for a few hours, you know, half a day, maybe. But, you know, 12 hours was, was pushing it. And that's when, you know, it wasn't super hot and I'd, whatever. It sat in the van all day through the heat while I was helping a buddy put in some insulation and earn some money. And uh, I'm really impressed. <laughs> this is going to save me a lot because, you know, even two bucks you know when you have to spend it more than once a day and you're homeless and jobless you know four or five bucks six bucks a day just on ice to keep stuff cold food and drinks cold you know to keep me alive it's, it's six bucks i really don't have all the time so but you know two bucks is another story you know two bucks lasts me over 24 hours which it, it, I fully expect to have ice still in the morning when I wake up. I'm just about to call it a night. Um, so that's really good. That's all, you know, like we're talking 36 hours of ice, which, you know, for my little cooler that is less than 20 bucks at Walmart, you know, just by adding the scraps of what I had left over from uh, insulating the windows by putting the scraps inside my cooler. I, you know, quadrupled the amount of time that my ice lasts in my cooler and keeps my stuff cold. So that's, that's just unbelievably cool. <laughs> you know, I couldn't ask for something better than that except to have a fridge and stuff, which, you know, I don't have power for anything really except to charge my phone <laughs> anyway i'm gonna keep making videos and keep letting you guys know how i'm doing i'm homeless but not helpless you know that's my motto i'm gonna stick to it i'm trying to stay positive and move forward in a positive motion i got more work tomorrow for my buddy it's not much yet but it's a start you know it's a step towards getting things turned around for myself i <coughs> I'd like to be, you know, out of here <laughs> and living back in a house or, or an apartment by before December comes, that's for sure. Before November, if I could help it, you know, that might be asking a little much. But the next step is to get some more insulation for the van. I need to do the floor in the van, which uh, in the last two windows, you know, which will ensure privacy and also insulate the windows in a much better way. And... Uh, then I definitely need to pull up the carpet and put some insulation along the floor because I feel like I'm getting more cold up through the floor than I am losing heat through the top. And hopefully I won't have to mess with the top. <laughs> hopefully I'll be back, back on my feet before that becomes necessary and before I have to worry about it getting too cold. Because last winter was really bad here and if it's the same this year, then... Yeah, <laughs> it would really suck to have to be here through the whole winter. Anyway, keep watching. Tell your friends. Tell everybody like, subscribe. View it lots of times. I will hopefully come up with more really cool things. To show you. I mean, anybody can do this with any cooler. Just get some Reflectix. <laughs> you know, some double-sided tape. Oops. I dropped. Oh on my phone and uh you know be amazed at how much longer your ice lasts i mean even if it's just for work or whatever all right have a good night my dome light just went out because it timed out see ya <laughs>